Hey y'all, Rhonda here. So excited to see you guys. Yes, I have been to the Dollar Tree and Five Below and Walgreens. Anyway, lots of good stuff to show you. So get your coat, good cup of tea, coffee, start your knitting, my little girls. And um, anyway, sit back, enjoy. Get you a pencil and paper and take some notes if there's something you want to get. Sorry, nose is itching. All the cedars are blooming. If you didn't know, the cedars are blooming. And we live in a forest with lots of cedars. So it's, it, have you ever seen one? Of, I know, here I go. Have you ever seen one of the videos of a cedar blooming, I, the pooping out pollen, I don't whatever they do. I mean, it is like this green cloud. I mean, it's phenomenal. Google it. It's wild. Anyway, nature's just wild. All right, let me make some room here. I'm so excited. Okay, speaking of excited, those of you who have been following me, you know I'm going to Creativations. Happy dance, happy dance. Anyway, it's getting closer and closer, and I'm getting so excited. A little anxious, but I'm getting very excited. So you will see some stuff that I'm going to be taking with me because I'm making goodie bags for my roommates, which oh, they're not going to be watching this, I'm sure. But um, my roommates and then my teachers that, you know, uh, Katie Pratee and Diane Wakely and some of them, I'm going to make little goodie bags for them. So anyway, all right, well, let's get going. All right. So, um, what that thing, Shetty? Okay. You guys, if you've been with me a while, you know, I have gone off the deep end, the peep end. I think it's COVID. You know, they've been, you see these little research things, you know, that COVID isn't affecting your guts and you're not, you know, uh, it's affecting the brain. Well, I'm beginning to believe it. Never into peeps before, never thought they were cute, but just walked right on by them. If you've seen my other Dollar Tree hauls, you know I have gone peep crazy. I, there's no other way to say it. So anyway, it continues since it's closer to Easter. Are those not stinking cute? And look, they even have little bunny butts. Look at that. Oh my goodness. I mean, I gotta take my pants. What is that not fun? I'd wear this the whole video, but it might be a little distracting for both of us because I'd be all like, hey. Just thought that was really cute. I wear these to work. I'm gonna wear them to work. Okay. Well, my daughter is all into um, flowers. She's done it, she's doing the FFA thing and she's really into horticulture and I, Anyway, I'm proud, but I'm just a little surprised. So, I was in the Dollar Tree looking at some flowers. I'm trying to be careful here. And she's all into purple. And I'm all into arranging flowers. Uh, arranging flowers? Arranging flowers. So, um, I got these, which, I, you know, doesn't look like much now, but um, they're holding hands. Anyway, for, you know, you got to have droopies. you got to have all kinds of um, textures and all that. So, remember this. Lay those gently because they're shedding a little bit. Okay. I had another bag with flowers. Okay. It's down here somewhere. We'll get to it in a minute. All right. Just remember those. Okay. So, you know, my daughter loves the Dollar Tree. I just need to go shopping. We can go to Nike. We can go to Dillard's. We can go to Belk. We can go to the Dollar Tree. That's where she wants to go. Okay. Cheap date, I guess. So, she saw this and just loved it. So, yeah, we got it. I mean, that is beautiful. So, I don't know, random things. Okay. These are really cute. These are little pillow covers. Can you see the, wait a minute. Oh, there we go. There we go. So, they zip. Let's just open them. Y'all get back drinking your tea or whatever. So, it's a canvas. It's a kind of like duck cloth or something. So, anyway, it is plain on one side and bunny butt on the other. Is that not cute? And they're like 15 by 15 and it zips and you just slide your pillow in there. So now I gotta go find some pillows. But aren't those cute? So we have a pink one and did I get two pink ones? I kind of got two pink ones. I thought there was a pink one and a, I thought there was another color. Maybe not. Anyway, I got two pink ones. So there we go. Okay, that's back to Okay, let me see. This is all just random. 
I should have done a better job of organize, organizing. If <laughs> you can tell, I'm excited. Okay, let me get those back. Love these. Sweet and salty mix. Has the peanuts and M&Ms, raisins, and sunflower kernels. These are great. So, you know, they're going in my snack bag for work and for my trip. Uh, my seventh, 16 year old. Um, sandwich bags. These are Arthur. <laughs> can you see the, is it too bright? There we go. So you can see that there's two different designs. So they're Arthur sandwich bags. That's an AJ thing. Um, I was just in the mood for Butterfingers. Love those. Oh, I never know what I'm going to find in here when AJ's been shopping. So she got some paintbrushes. I don't know what she's up to. She loves to pour paint. But um, I don't know what she's going to do to be continued. All right, more of these. All right, let me pull these out. I think I have another one somewhere. Okay, yeah, I have another one of these somewhere. Okay, these are actually pencil sharpeners or crayon sharp sharpeners. My, my light there. Dr. Seuss. But, oh, there's Dr. Seuss himself. But it has a sharpener on the back. I'm going to pull that sucker off. And then there'll be, it's a it's a rubbery, they're kind of a rubbery thing. I'm going to pull those off and put them on the Dr. Seuss book. Dr. Seuss has some friends. Look at that. Is that not cute? And like I said, I'm sure I can just pull that sharpener off. And then look. Oh my goodness. There's another one in here. I'm pretty sure I got four. All right. So now we're going to start some of this goodie bags. And I know I got way, wait, because every time I see something, I think, oh, that'd be good for the goodie bag. When I put all this out, spread it out on my bed, you'll come along with me. And I start packing the goodie bags. It ain't, it's not going to fit in there. So we have some utterly smooth hand cream, which this is really good. So I've got several of those. And then these are really neat. These are sassy and chic, fashionable file, uh, nail file with case. So look at those. And they have a little, they're in a little case. So I can open these and I mean, that's two right there for two different people. So these are just little, you know, like if you forget your Tylenol, if you need a little, I don't know, something. Well, I just thought these would be perfect. So I mean, that's a lot you could put in there. So these are the little, um, there's banana, cherry, grape, and apple. So they're little um, uh, um, gums. COVID brain. So anyway, so I could do like one of each in their little bags. All right. Then I just thought these were so cute. These are makeup removal pads. Are those not cute? And so I have another, I have a, yeah, another one. So I have three roommates and then I have my teachers. But um, I just thought those were really neat. And then everybody needs a band-aid or two because, you know, we're in the crafting world and paper cuts. So go SpongeBob. Band-aids. That just makes you smile, right? Um, got a little razor to take with us. This is... I don't know where those came from. Oh, so this is Sassy and Chic. These are large nail files, which I needed. These are really good. Because, you know, with the... Um, what do you call it? the um, gel, you know, under the ultraviolet, you know, you have that top coat, so you've got to file that down, and then you put your stuff on there to make it bubble up and get rid of it. Uh, yeah, I know. Um, anyway, so those are really good for that. So little hand sanitizers for sanitizing and my crafters, it gets the oil off, it gets ink off, it's good. So um, I actually got several of these in different, this is um, aloe. Moisturizes with vitamin E and aloe. And then, oh, for Easter baskets and stuff, we got kisses. And then these uh, mini pops, charms, tons of cool flavors. So I thought, you know, just a little something, something. You know, your blood sugar's getting low. You need a little something. You got a bad taste in your mouth, you know. And then we have moisturizing foot treatment mask. That'll be fun. So there's two of them in there because you have two feet. Um, and you put these on and you like leave them for, I don't know, 60 minutes or something. And then your feet are just miraculously awesome. Uh, okay. Daughter. 
deodorant. Then I just thought these would be fun. Everybody needs a little tissue. So we had to get the cute little packs. So those are in my cart. And then I keep looking. And who doesn't love Mickey? You know, it's all about having fun. That's that's what it's all about. So I got those. Oh, there's another mask. Oh, and then I guess AJ got these little emery boards. So there's some more. Okay. Let's keep going. All right. So here, let me see if I can hang this right here. It's going to stay? Okay. Here we go. A peat tablecloth. I mean, not that it's, I, it's going to look like peat throw up in my house. I, I don't know what it is about this, but I have gone peat crazy. So this one happens to be 52 by 70 inch tablecloth. Wipe it clean. So it's kind of a canvasy whatever. So this was a $3 item, but come on, look at that. So I'll have to put my, my peat tablecloth and then put down something else to kind of break it up because it's going to be full of peeps. And I need, you know, you, you got to have something to calm the eye down. And I just love bags. So I saw this. So this is what I use, like my snack bags, these kind of things. And they're just handy to have. I take them to Aldi's. I take them to, you know, you just need something to grab and go. And I just thought that was really cute. If they didn't have a peep one or I would have got it. Okay. So, um, dinosaurs, wait a minute, mm, let me put something behind it, here we go, dinosaur stickers, I mean, those are really cool, are they not? So I have a little, um, pile of dinosaur stuff, because I'm making a dinosaur album, and so I'm gathering up stuff, and it's just, you know, I saw those and thought it would be really cool. Wow, speaking of fingerprints, these are... Look how dense. These are nine and a half by six inch by Jot, 120 sheets, three subject notebook, college rule. This is a great size. They come in different colors. And this is just, you know, to take notes, make notes. I use these for idea sheets, um, notes to myself, you know, making lists of my ink colors, whatever. This is really a not, and this fits in your purse really easy too. Unless you have a big old purse, and then you could use the, you know, the big ones, but that's a really good size. I know. I know. I Don't even go there. I know. That's a head scratcher. You remember Arsenio Hall? Some of y'all too young for that. But Arsenio Hall, and he had a segment in his show that was called Things That Make You Go, Hmm. This is one of those. A peep coloring book. Coloring and activity book. Let's get that straight. But we, it's full of peeps. Look at that. I have no words for that. So, let me see, let me see here. All right, so I'm thinking, you know, with my um, Dr. Seuss, you know, my little thing, we're gonna make a journal, Dr. Seuss journal. And I saw these and I thought these would be great because the bright colors for Dr. Seuss. They're just little treat bags in different sizes. There's one smaller and this one. Just the bright colors. Love that. Um, those are great for junk journaling. And I know some of y'all are going to like, junk journaling is not bright and happy. Oh, yes, it is. It is. Junk journaling is whatever you want it to be. If you want it to be romantic and pretty. If you want it to be, you know, grungy like Tim Holtz. If you want it to be happy and crazy, then that's what it is. Um, we have more of the nail files in the little cases. So we got those. Then, what else do I have? Oh, dropped my sack there. So anyway, I, more. I just got a handful of these because they're just nice to have. And another one. All right, get back up there. All right. Oh, here's my little friends. Here's my other Dr. Seuss. Thing one and thing two. Are those not cute? All right. So speaking of the junk journaling, I just thought. These were stinking cute. Let me do that one over there. These are just little books. Let me show you here. Cute little books. We have uh, Hansel and Gretel. We have a three Billy Goat Gruff. Billy Goat's Gruff. We have Henny Penny and Ten Little Monkeys. 
and they I, they have the cutest illustrations. Look at that. Is that not cute? Let me show you. And then Hansel and Gretel. That's a little different. But love the illustrations. And then we have uh, uh, the three Billy Goat Gruff, Billy Goats Gruff. But I love the illustrations. Look. Oh. Let me find it again. Quick. Things that make you go, hmm. I know I couldn't help myself. And then a Henny Penny. Of course, the you know, chicken craze is on. Look at all the chickens and the turkeys, the ducks. Yep. Okay. And then I I mean these are Looney Tunes. This is the real deal. This is not like a knockoff. This is the Looney Tunes. And I just look at the bright colors. Does that not just make you happy? I mean makes me happy all right so along with that let me see those till the end and then these I wish I could have found some different ones but I'm going to tear them up anyway not really tear them up but so these are classic tales this is the little book of classic tales and the little book of princess tales so it's they're already I don't know if the of course you kind of get what you pay for but the outer cover is kind of funky but great illustration I mean, just really pretty illustrations. So I'll take these out and then I'll I'll redo this um, this cover and spine and make it into a little journal. Stay. And then the same thing with the princess tails. And just really pretty illustrations. So fun gun drilling, that's all gonna fall. Okay, and then if you watch my channel, which you should be watching, and you should be subscribing. Hit that little subscribe button and your like button. It helps me out. Um, you know I got a cinch. One of those thermal cinch by We Are. The brand new. A lot of mixed reviews. Um, I don't know. Kind of 50-50. You love it or you hate it and you're sending it back. It's one of them, they, somebody said that the element, they, they tried twice and it wouldn't heat up. So it sounds like an element thing. Um, after I did my review, um, I had one lady that said, you know, because it's so lightweight. She got it in, hadn't even unboxed it, but you have to like hold the machine to push the, the timer. So she was worried because her grandkids are with her all the time. So she was worried about it knocking over and all of that stuff. I can understand that. Um, some of it is just user error. I don't know, but I, so far I'm liking mine, having good luck with it. So um, I just thought these would be really cute. So too much light. There we go. So they're little composition notebook covers. They're actually shape decor. Like these are the teachers. It's called the teaching tree. 36 pieces. Um, so it's decorations, you know, like for teachers. And, you know, they have ships and they have uh, bouncy balls. They have all kinds of stuff. But these are the composition notebooks. So I thought I might need some composition notebooks in my little thermal machine. Wouldn't that not be cute? I think so. All right. Oh, we emptied another sack. Okay. We're doing a good on time? All right, where are, we? where are we? Let's see, what is this? Is this Dollar Tree? Oh, yeah, this is a heavy one. Okay, this is, I'll go kind of quick. Um, I do got some new toothbrushes. Um, oh, gonna stay. I just thought these would be really cool. These are light readers, reading light highlighters. Um, so you put these, there's actually 10 pieces, 10 of these in here. So there's different designs. Okay, and so it has the little um, vellum piece, or not vellum, acetate piece in there, different colors. So what the kids do is they put it on their, on their book, their words, and then they put this on one sentence, they read that, and they move it down, read the next sentence, move it down, so that way they're not overwhelmed by the whole page of, of words. But I thought these were really cute. They could be used as book markers, belly bands, all kinds of stuff for junk journaling. So I got those. God, this is heavy. This is mine. AJ's gotta go get her fixed. She loves the tea. She likes Arizona tea, but they were out. So this is brisk iced tea. Sweet tea. Anyway, she hits the bottle quite frequently. Okay, let's put that right over there. All right. So then, oh, and then I was telling her, double dip chocolate covered peanuts. So, and these are the Landmarks Confes Confections. Okay, these are not sugar-free. 
because they do have sugar-free that are really good. I was telling her this is a really good brand. I love these. So if you need a little fix and you don't need a lot of sugar, that's a good one. So what do we have here? Brisk iced tea, blood orange. Okay. That's an AJ thing. Oh, more of those little file things in the yeah. And then, oh, she, she want, I don't know what she wants with scotch tape, but she got scotch tape. And then, oh, she got her some Vaseline lip therapy, aloe vera. And they have a lot of good lippy do things. Okay, so into that. All right, so are we done with dog hair? Oh, nope, hang on. So, here is some more flowers that I got. So remember the flowers that I showed you before? So I was looking at the eggs. Oh, so we have several of these. There's some more of those. So it's actually what caught my eye was the, oh, there's some more. That's for texture. Okay, here we go. So I was looking at these with the little eggs. I just thought those were stinking cute. And they're a little shiny. And so they have the blue, the purple, and the kind of the peachy. So I was looking at those and then AJ was like, oh my God, look at all the purples. So then I thought, okay. So then we had to get some more of those. Some little hyson looking flowers. And then, you know, we'll have the long drapey, you know, over the edge of the vase. Anyway, I'll show you when I put it all together. I love to arrange flowers. Actually, I have a uh, one of the big hotels here in town, which, you know, we have a ton of hotels. It's called Lodge of the Ozarks. And when you walk in, uh, it's beautiful. You can see, I think it's three stories tall in the lobby. Big fireplace. I mean, it goes all the way up. You know, the big leather furniture, really rustic, beautiful. And when you walk in, the first thing you see is this antique trunk, antique trunk, and my arrangement on top of it, which is probably about four foot tall and about three foot wide. It's a big arrangement. Anyway, very proud of that one. Okay. So, are we good on the Dollar Tree? I think so. All right. So, oh, Dollar Tree. I just thought this was really pretty wrapping paper you could use for birthdays, for I mean, any occasion. Love it. Even junk journaling. But, anyway, got that. Okay. We're going to move on to, um, I just, I think this is, okay. We went to Walmart because it's FFA week. And, you know, one day they will do, um, it's dress and camo. One day is red, white, and blue. One day is FFA. Um, anyway, the different things. So we had to go get some camo. So tomorrow was camo day. And then she saw this shirt, which she was like, oh my God, mom, look. So nice t-shirt. She got a big one. I'm going to have to shrink it because I know she's going to work to school because this is way too big. But um, anyway, kind of a nice shirt. But anyway, I like that. So... I did really well. I refrained. I reined it in, probably because AJ was hollering at me. And, you know, gotta go, gotta go. But I did find something. Don't judge me. Just don't. It's a blanket. And then you just get a little peep with it. It says bunny plush with and blanket. Ain't that not cute? And it's a blanket all rolled up. And I can throw this over the... But I can't put these out because Rory, my corgis, will go, oh, uh, looky here. Look, it's even got the little people in its butt. Oh, my God. I know. I, I don't I, I don't want to hear it. I, nope. I don't want to hear it. Okay. So let's go to Five Below. That wasn't good. These canvas bags. They have kind of leather-looking handles. And there's the back of it. But it's a... Anyway, it's a nice bag. I mean, you're big. You can see how big it is. It's just, you know, it's just plain, wide open. But look how big it is. So, again, I mean, this was, you know, great to go shopping. Um, oh, yeah, and look, the bottom goes flat. I love that. So, there's a lot of room in this thing. And, and it looks like you can just wipe it off. It's called Summer Tote. Anyway, it was $5. So, I thought that was really cool. Okay, um, I have an avalanche here. Oh, wait a minute. Back to the Dollar Tree. More sandwich bags. Dinosaur. Dinosaur train. Can you see the little... There we go. That's what they look like inside. Okay. Oh, and then uh, more bags. Happy little bags. And then I held these before, but Dr. Seuss stickers. So they have all kinds of little stickers. 
let it go uh, go be <laughs> will go great with the journal so like I said I hauled those before and then we have lots more snacks and then we have the little antibacterial travel wipes goodie bags and I got you know more of those oh and then we have Dr. Seuss I hauled these before flashcards but on one side, you know, they have the numbers, but then on the other side, can you see? I mean, it has the characters. So that'll be really cool. And then let's see what else did I get in here. Oh, more of the little hand lotion. And just a bunch more of those. Okay, that's good. Oh, here's the, these are Russell Stover's sugar-free caramel, caramel candy in chocolate. Anyway, those are really good. Like I said, sugar-free. All right, anything else? Nope. Okay. All right, all right. Those are empty bags. Okay. Now we're going to five below. Let me go below and get it. Some of it. Okay, I've seen this on Insta Tick Face, whatever. All those influencers. And I saw this, um, what can I remember her name? Crafty Girl? Anyway, she is like the Dollar Tree queen she's been doing dollar tree hauls almost daily for I don't know how many years she's like traveling around the united states going to dollar trees she's the real deal she's the dollar dollar tree queen and um so anyway she was on she saw this on somebody else's insta face tiktok thing so she was on the hunt for this couldn't find it anywhere and finally her mom found it for her and i think she got two of them different colors but i was strolling through five below and just happened to look over there and I found me one. So it's a keyboard. It's a typewriter keyboard and it's a Bluetooth. So it's kind of, and it and has the clickies, you know? And so this, this little, see the black line, the little slot right there, you put your phone or your tablet or whatever and prop it up there and then you Bluetooth it and then you type away. Isn't that not cool? And it's not very big. I mean, I'm excited about this. And this was, um, this was $10. Yeah. And it kind of has that, you know, some, and I, I have a really cool keyboard for my big computer, my, my desktop. And it has that, I don't know why we like that, but we do. So, um, anyway, this has a little bit of that sound. Oh, okay. Let me see. I'm going to drop some stuff here. It'll all come out. Okay. Okay. So now we're at five below. Got that at five below. So I bought these. This is for my goodie bags. I know my bags are not going to be big enough. So I got a pink, purple, and blue. Teal. Yeah, baby blue. And their hair, they're called Butterfly. Feel the quality. Soft elastic uh, with great stretch and uh, no tension. Um, you can't see it on that one. What does it say? It's a hair towel. But anyway, so you know, you flip your hair upside down and it kind of has the long tail and you twist it and it has a little button in the back. I just thought these were really super cute. And these were like four bucks. So, yeah, I did. All right, then, okay. But I have to be done. Okay, I, I'm sure these are for little kids because they're so little, but I they'll fit on my pinky. They're pink fingernails. I know, but look at them. How cute is that? So I could just put one on my pinky and then, you know, paint my other ones to match or whatever. But they're little. So, oh, it says try me. Oh, you can just put your nail up there like that. But yeah, press on nails, directions for safe use, whatever. But these are not, look at those. You know, I'm going to do it. I got a bunch. I got two and I'm going to do it. All right. I just thought these would be really handy too. These are Tums, Chewy Bites, Assorted Berries, Extra Strength, Eight Chewables. So little Tums for the little bags. Okay, these are super cool. I don't care who you are. These are lip gloss. So we have Sour Patch and we have Tootsie Roll. Are you kidding me? Look at that. So on Tootsie Roll, we have Blow Pop Cherry, we have Sugar Daddy, we have Blue Raspberry, Tootsie Roll, Blow Pop Grape, Fluff, 
fluffy stuff, cotton candy, junior mints, and dots. And then we have the Sour Patch. We have orange, lime, raspberry, all the Sour Patch color uh, flavors. Look at that. Are these not going to be great for little stuffers in, in bags? Just AJ's friends? Come on. Okay, I'm going down again. Okay, um, get the bag. Okay, wait. Okay. Well, if you've ever been to Five Below, you know they have an area with lots of books. So I always have to stop and look. Actually, I got AJ three books, but I already gave them to her. Um, one of them was Stuff I've Already Done. I don't know. It was just kind of a, I don't know, really cute. But I thought this was very interesting. I know you can't read backwards. Okay, this is How Money Works. The Facts Visually Explained. Um, so it goes through, and I mean, I thought this would be good for anybody, but, you know, AJ. Foreign Exchange and Trading. Um, day Trading. So about the stock market. Government Finance and Public Money. I mean, it tells about how all the how money works. Government borrowing, accountability, um, quantitative easing, uh, balance of payments, how oh, how government fail, how the government how governments fail, debt and default, personal finance, um, oh, generating income, investments for income. I mean, shares, managing investments, um, optimizing your portfolio, debt loans i mean this is really really cool so i'm gonna read it then i'm gonna pass it along to everybody else i just thought that was just you know stuff we need to know i mean you hear about you know government writing trillion dollar checks and stock market you know you hear all this stuff and it, it doesn't compute all always unless you have business degree which my husband does but i saw this and i thought that's just really because aj and i you know when you get in the car with kids especially at night you know when it's dark I don't know we have some really wild conversations about all kinds of stuff but anyway so she was asking about stocks and you know how it works and interest and loans and all that and so anyway, I saw this I'm thinking you know and it has pictures we love pictures so anyway I just thought that was very interesting okay and then I was a little disappointed in five below five below if you're listening which I know you're not they had all these fantastic uh, phone cases but they were all for iPhones. Some of us don't do iPhones. The world is not an iPhone place. I mean, it's there's a lot of iPhones, but there's a lot of Android people out there. I'm one of them. So I looked everywhere. Cases here, cases over there, all these little... It's all for iPhones. So I'm like, that's not cool. But anyway, so I did see this, and I thought it was really cute. And I do have a clear case for my phone um, that I have a pop socket on. Because, it, you know, it's one of the big phones. And... um Anyway, but it's just kind of, I've had it for a while. And I saw this and I thought, this would be fun to take on my trip. But look, it just makes you happy. I don't know if you can see, but it's actually glittery. I mean, it's like really sparkly, shiny. So it's a pop socket. And it's, I mean, it's a good size, which, I mean, the pop, you know, where you put your finger is a lot smaller. But I just love it. It's glittery and it's smiley. So I thought, well, I can put that on my clear case for my phone. It just makes me happy. Extra bag. And then my daughter, she is a big kid. She loves, a, you know, a good bottle of slime. So this is crazy slimy. Oh, I can even smell it. Sweet scent, purple smoothie. Is that not funny? So she can just, I don't know, whatever you just squeeze slime, you just, I, whatever you do with slime. Anyway, I thought that'd be good for her Easter basket. Thought that would be fun. Okay, we are getting there. We are winding down here. Hang on, I'm going down again. Oh, hang on. Okay. So, more. Look, this is Hershey's lip balms. We have Jolly Rancher, Icebreakers, S'mores, Reese's Twizzlers, Bubblegum, Jolly Rancher, and Hershey's chocolate. Are those not killer? So, you know what I thought about doing? <laughs> I know Valentine's Day is past, but you know, it doesn't have to be Valentine's Day. I thought I might try some of these. Kiss Keith and see if he can guess what flavor it is. Okay. That's all right. This isn't a kid-friendly show, so I can say that. All right. What else do we have in here? Oh, and I got Jolly Rancher. Look, all the Jolly Rancher flavors. It's the real stuff. I just may keep all those. I don't know. Okay. Oh, and then we got another Tums thing to go in the, yeah. Okay. 
And then, oh, I got this for me. This is um, Erase Your Face, Reusable Makeup Removing Cloths. So that's that microfiber or whatever. You can, you know, do this and your face is gone. So I thought those would be good to take them a trip. Okay. Okay. The, I, I'm if I, if I get something else, I'm going to need therapy. I think this is the last thing. I'm not going to go shopping anymore until after. That's probably not. Anyway, until after Easter. It's Peeps Lip Balm. And see that little peep right there? It's, um, what is it? Four lip balms. Oh, it's a six pack, six pack lip set. What is the back? The little peep does something. It opens up. I don't know. It does something, but it's Peeps. I, I don't know. It needs to be an intervention. Okay. It's a lip balm, and see that it's a little keychain with the peep, and the lip balm fits in the back of the little peep. This is great marshmallow cream. I know. I know. I, I don't even know what to say. I have no excuses. Okay, is this it? I think this is going to be it. I need this in my bathroom because I have lots of makeup brushes. And I just thought this would be fantastic because I do have holders for them, but I have different sets, you know, by different companies and my Laura Geller and my, yeah. And so I just thought those, this would be really handy. I mean, it's, it's heavy plastic. It's very well made. So anyway, I'm going to be doing some house cleaning tomorrow and rearranging. And I thought this would be good to do. Okay. I think that's it. If it's not, it should be. That's all I got to say. Is that it? Okay. That's it. Okay. I don't want to hear any comments about the peeps. If you're just tuning in, you think I'm peep crazy, go back and watch my other haul videos of Dollar Tree. Because I have every peep thing from Dollar Tree that is out there, I think. All right. Well, I hope you enjoyed. Um, if you're still here watching, thank you. Um, allergies, my eyes are itching. Um, if you're still hanging out with me, thank you. Um, until next time. Bye for now.